All right, everybody. Welcome to Farming Simulator 17 here on No Creek Farms. Your host with not the most, well, sometimes. <laughs> well, we're going to go get the disc. As you can see, we got the auger wagon set up and the gravity wagon there. But won't be using them for no time soon. We'll just get them up. And and getting them ready in between uh, combine dumps. Oh, well, we don't need that. Yeah, pull up here. Make sure I don't hit nothing. We're going to back up. Alright, we're all hooked up. Go ahead and get out of here. Without hitting the walls, hopefully. Oh, that train's starting it again. We got a train changing out cars and stuff here for uh, Delta Asphalt. They do rocks and stuff like that. But anyway, folks, today I have Bill 1 completely fertilized. And I got to change the GPS out. I should have went down there and got the road there but uh we're going to just auto correct our size here and we're going to take that off scoop this over to about right there that looks pretty good and let's go just a no notch or two yeah there we go all right um we got the combine going over there uh Max Sands driving it today, or so far, and uh, yeah. Get our stuff here. I love this disc. Now, some of y'all are saying that this this is too big for this tractor. I, I agree. I agree. Uh, but it does pull it pretty good. Um, we might find a bigger tractor later. But, you know, mostly what it's just going to do is go slower. You have to go a couple of years slower to, to be able to pull it like it's should be pulled but it's still tilling up the ground pretty good so that's what we're wanting and uh, as soon as I get him over here get him straight stuff we'll look at the ground and show you the fertilization and stuff like that but other than that I see here 46% uh, canola is what the combine's at right now so won't be too much longer Alright, we're going to get GPS started. And what I like to do, just go a couple of feet and stuff, make sure it's all good and straight, and I can go out hire a worker. Now I'm working as a worker. Or, oh, I'm going to put my HUD back on. We got Kyle and Julian driving the 8R. Alright. Let's see, we need to. We got a uh, 36,880 and uh, bag so far. Like I said, I was setting this up. I don't know if it needs to go into that bottom hole or if it needs to go at the very top. This is set up a little bit different. It's looks like uh, you know pipes going across drop seeds down. And it looked like it should have been an elevator or something. But I don't know. Maybe we put it in the top of that first one there. And that goes across. We just have to see. Alright, Max Sands half. Maybe a over half. Should be able to get down and back. Um, we're almost going to wrap this up, but look, I hope so. Now let's see, just take a gander to see uh, what. 
Oh, I can't change the things because it's hard work. I don't like him going out in the road like that. It, it'd be alright. As long as no cars coming, he'll watch for cars and stuff. And that, that's pretty much it. Uh, I want to step out and go look at our cows. See how messy they are. And a little bit of a mess, not too much. I wish our manure would uh, be on up there some more. It's not big of a pile right there. Um, check the grass out here. I think this is 100% by now. Yep, that's 100%. So we can, we got a big field right here we can do. Um, you can kind of see it. Ah, come on, controller, stop moving. Well, you can see where I'm at, and uh, it's that clear spot right there. I cleared the trees out and stuff, so. And, uh, well, since he's doing all right, I'm just going to let Colin do his thing, and we're going to go over here to the combine. And, uh, oh, somebody left their lights on. The engine not running. That's not good. I got 17,900 in here. That's pretty. That's all on this field right here. What I got so far. So. Ooh, I almost done it. But yeah. Uh, you know we. we Got to sell the canola and stuff here pretty soon, but we're gonna put it in that bag until the price comes up. Get going kind of good here, and we're gonna go up just a little more. There we go. Uh, left shift and one activates the. Uh, you can see the bottom right corner there, where S1 six point three is uh highlighted in green uh i can hit left shift and one and it'll make it pop up that speed or i can go shift and then two and it'll go to 12.5 and shift three so when you stop here when you go to the vehicle group you have to leave one two and three out and not put no tractors or nothing like that in there and uh because if you do you'll be switching to that vehicle and you won't get your uh course speed right there and stuff so yeah well folks check out that map up there rain 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 four days of rain but we are early autumn so i guess it's about right I'm going to shut the motor off while we're waiting here. And, you know, playing a game like this, it's usually what you have to go through. You just, especially if you got one combine going. You know, I wish we had the money to go ahead and lease another one. But, folks, uh, check this out. Uh, Sun Flyers shows where you can start today, but. You know how it did with the bean or with the canola. It was like the second day or third day or whatever. And, um, which we still on the same day. So it was what, one, two, three, on the third day before we could, uh, start harvesting. It was autumn. First day of autumn when, uh, we started. So that might be the same way with the sunflowers. You know, that would be. This one here. But you know, you notice something, Mo? And this is what I don't understand. It says we can plant. See, planting season. And wheat. We can plant wheat. Might wait a couple of days and plant some wheat because we need some straw. 
But question is, when can we harvest it? That's the next question. So that's going to be kind of, you know, iffy on that. I got to learn some stuff about that. Let's see here. Oh, got to start the motor back. I'm going to come back down to this end here. And, uh, I think what I'm going to do is change his direction instead of up and down. I'm going to get him to go around. And then, uh, yeah, go, go, whoa, what am I doing? I gotta turn around here real quick. Turn around. All right, now the combine. Oh, there we go. All right, Max, I'm gonna have to fire you for a little bit. That and personal. You should be able to choose who you want to drive it. Maybe they'll put that in uh, 19. Let's see here. I'm going to put that in circle. And uh, I'm going to be going on the left side. So that should work. That way we'll have to pipe out all the time. And uh, here we go. All right. Done that right. Good. I gotta figure out what this is. Uh, that's headlands. You can have some headlands you can go through, and that's your turning. Straight reverse. I think that will work. And you can pause it and all that stuff. But not a bad little mod once you get used to it. Alright, uh, oh. Mr. Colin there, sir, you going on across. That's, that's good. Um. Turn these lights off since we're out in the field. Since I got quite a bit in here, I'm going to go ahead and go on up here. Whoa. Speed set at 6 for some reason. I guess because the last course I had. Now this episode ain't going to be as long as the other one. But uh, I do want to start making longer videos again. You know. Um... I don't know, if y'all watch them, y'all watch them, if you don't, you don't, because I know there's few people that do want longer episodes, and there's some that don't, so it's hard to please everybody, so I think I'm going to probably start shooting for 45 minute videos, and that's kind of half and half, because I used to do hour, hour and 10 minute, hour video to hour and 10 minute videos, and I know that was kind of long, but you know, it's, it's hard to get everything done within that amount of time, so. I gotta slow this buggy down. I probably won't do it on this one. Because we'll probably uh, trade. I think we're leasing this one, ain't we? I'm pretty sure we are. Oh, this is a slow process doing that. But you can see that bag getting fuller and fuller. Oh. I think what I need to do is go in here and set the over the overloader speed on the bag system. And that way it'll take it faster. I think that's what I'll do. Almost there, folks. Almost there. One or two more. One more. All right. Good to go. Let's see uh, how much we got in here now. We got uh, whoa, 65,000. Okay. I might be off my thing there because I said between 50 and 75. And uh, we got that at 65. All right. I don't know which one's easier to do, but uh, I hate untatcher. Oh, he's done. 
Oops, shoot this motor on. Let's go over and uh, might be just easier to unhook this disc and put fertilizer with back on. Oh yeah, he went. Out. Oh man, missed out on that down there. We'll go get that real quick. All right, no nothing but a ain't nothing but a thing. Ain't nothing but a thing, baby. Yeah, I kind of like the old school music, but I, I, I do like the, the up-to-date music, too. And just in case some of y'all was wondering. But, uh, let's see here. Our fuel is good. I like the way this tractor is inside, but I don't like the buddy seat up that far. But one of those things. Ooh, look at this valley right here. Huh. Huh. All right. I do love this this here. I just wish it was kind of like a... Uh, plow and cultivator in a way and then you can select which one you want that way you can use it to plow with and then after you fertilize you can come back and use it as a cultivator and it'll put like the spine boards at the back whatever you want to call them the, got the little fingers that breaks up the clods more I think that would be neat not supposed to cut that sharp but Oh well. I think we'll go ahead and uh, finish out this end here while we're waiting on the combine. The combine's 69, 70 percent. So get that GPS locked on. Oh, it's off. That's another thing, you know, it don't look like it should get off like that. But it does. And good, our, our, our arter wagon's up here with the combine, so as soon as we get done here, we'll go and uh, empty him out. Pretty sure he's going to be pretty close to full time we get done here. All right, we'll fold this bad boy up. That's neat how that folds. It's a big this so it's it's 50 foot, and it really needs a a quad track or something on it, or something with more power. But I do need to get another tractor. So I'll probably be doing a lot of bale harvesting off screen. And uh, getting all that done. I ain't going to worry about that little bit right there. It's, I'll park this there. We really. Let's go and load the combine real quick. Because it's 90%. And then we'll get back and spray a little bit. And once he makes another round around the field there, we're going to put him back over here and to go up and down. Just want to make sure he has plenty of turning room. Yeah, J Metal 797. 95% full. Brother, I'm fixing to unload you. And, and to all those that don't know what I'm talking about when I say brother, he's not actually my brother, but I would treat him like, whoa, whoa, what happened here? It'll be unloaded time I get it. It's supposed to, there we go. Guess I didn't hit the button, but, but I would treat all the, all my, people like brothers and sisters because that's what kind of love I got for y'all you know help y'all any way I can within my powers 
So when I say uh, in the comments or something, I say something about brother, how can I help you or, or thanks brother. Uh, it's, just remember, you know, they're my brother, but not that way. I'm the only child, so I don't have no brother and sister. All right, I'm just going to park this guy right here. Yeah, I better get out of there. Yeah, back up out of the way. Yeah, we're going to walk down here. I, I missed some spots over in here. Next time I mow the grass and stuff, we want to make sure I get it all. I don't know why I go to that side for. Yeah, we're going. Let's see, he's already unhooked. Start it back up. We can go down on that far end down there. Which we got a lot of fertilizing to do now. Because I can go back and spray that field now. And uh, it'll be ready to cultivate. And then I can spray it again. Because that way, if I do all the spraying, I don't have to re rely on the planter to, to fertilize we can get one of the cheaper ones that don't have fertilization on it. Yeah, I'm going to have to get the GPS back on because that straw right there is really, really hard to deal with. Get it moved over. Maybe it'll go that far. All right, about right there. I'm going to have to... See if I can see through this tree line. All right, that that should do it right there. Be close enough anyway. All right, get this guy over. Uh, uh oh, I just made a boo boo. Crack my whiff here. Yes, yeah, so that's a big difference right there. I'm going to start right there and can't see it down there. I'm going to hope that's it right there. All right. Let's see who we're going to have doing this. All right. Let's see if I can hear Mr. Yankee. All right. Thank you, Mr. Yankee. I'm going to stay with you for a little bit. Make sure you don't try to turn around these trees. Don't mean nothing by that, but usually if you're this close to a tree, it'll sense it and then thinks it needs to turn around. I don't know why it does that, but... Alright. J-Metal over there is 45%. So he should be easily make it back around. Alright, Mr. Yankee's doing pretty good. Alright, 65,000 in that. And we're just waiting here patiently. Let's see what J Middle's doing over here. All right, I'm gonna stop him for a second and just instead of him making a square right there, I'm gonna do it this way, and hopefully we'll get J Metal back. Oh, we got J Boo. Let's see here, Donna, Jamie, J Metal. There we go. We got J Metal back. Let's see if it's actually a man or a female. Alright, J Metal, thank you. And Mr. Yankee, let's see. Alright, I think I got it down this time for keeping the uh, names with the, the gender, you know, because last time I done it, 
there's a female and there's a man thing, you know. I wish it was a way we could run this without this tractor being on there. See, this is where we need a bigger, powerful tractor. And that way, you know, we can be dissing. But that's why, one reason why I want another tractor is to uh, put that disc on it. Uh, J Metals. Uh, so it's fertilizing, so harvesting 72%. So I'm just going to get down this way a little bit. But the Massey ha handles this uh, wagon here just perfectly. Uh, I like its wagon. Uh, it could hold a little bit more. But, uh, yeah, it's a uh, Brent uh, V800. So, yeah. Uh, it does have, oh, it don't have a tarp cover to it. So we don't have to get one that has a tarp. Uh, I wish it was a way that we could, uh, yeah, that would go with the auger, which I can't see it, so. Alright, there goes that. Oh, why is it going 12? I hit, I hit one. Try to do this first person for y'all. Without messing up. Wish my camp. Whoa. Uh oh. Oh no. I got. I got to stop him. Stop. Stop. No. Oh my God. He wasted spray. Oh. See. See the front wheels right there. Yeah. You know? Right there's where my front wheels went in. So to let y'all know, crop destruction is on. Okay, well that got sprayed right there, so I need to move this over then, so I don't double spray. Yeah, about right there. Alright, let's move this over. Oh, me. Because the green line is the center line. And, uh, yeah, just I'm I'm gonna probably stop it about right there, and that should do it. Let's let's check the fertilization out. We ain't done that yet. Uh, there you go. You can see what's been harvested and what's not. Let's zoom in here. And there you go. So we got J Metal 797 finishing the harvester. And as you can see here, why does that turn colors? I only sprayed this once. It should be looking like that. Maybe it's because I plowed it. That's odd. I'm going to have to check that out. Cause I only put one dose of fertilizer on this, and this is one dose, but this has been plowed, and that's the second color, and this is the third color. So, huh? All right, let's check her three hundred and ten thousand on the loan, and our cow's gonna need some power food, which we'll probably do that after we finish this field. And uh, so, yeah. Let's see. Let's go around to our combine. I oh, know. Let's uh, go ahead and dump this in the hopper here. And see how much we have then. 
Now, folks, I think I'm going to go ahead and call it an episode after I do this because uh, it's going to take longer than 15 minutes to finish this, I believe. So, uh, I don't want to go too long, but I do want to make sure I get quite a bit done. But I don't want to bore y'all to death either. So, uh, yeah. and I'm going to try to go into this bag system here and see if I can speed this thing up but that would be more grateful just hit the button and let it unload and go on doesn't have to sit here and tap it all day you know but uh yeah J Metal's coming on around I was going to stop him but I forgot so we'll just let him keep going working And uh, when he comes back around, I have him finish that over there so we can spray and then finish this. And uh, yeah. So, folks, uh, you been watching No Creek Farms. And I hope y'all enjoyed it. Yeah, see, he can go down there with that pass and finish that and then finish that. So, we're almost done. I'm going to finish the rest of the harvesting off screen. And probably pick back up from there a little bit, maybe. So, yeah. Y'all have a great day, a blessed day, and I will see y'all later, folks.